Hello everyone, my name is Eric and welcome back to Space Hulk Deathwing. We have finished the first objective and now we're going on a purge and kill or kill and purge, I can't remember the name of it, but we're going to purge the nearby uh, nearby gene stealer hive. Which is there's plenty of them everywhere. So let's see now. Um We're supposed to go over here. So, does that mean that I can just go straight across, perhaps? By the nitrogen? No. So, hopefully, it will be simpler. It will be simpler. I hope so, at least. I hope, I really freaking hope so. Also, I need to remember that my, my, my apothecary only has a limited amount of. Of steam packs that you can use on us. Look at that! There's something here. What's this? There's something blue. It's an auto save too. Oh, something, something. Ah, oh, it's a report. Machine room, operational, operational. Placing. Well, we have kind of destroyed your little fuses. So sorry about that. Nah, not really. Screw the Mechanicum. They're always uh, assholes about stuff. Need to save technology. Well, they're trying to do what they do best, which is hopefully not to screw over people too much. I mean, they, they are doing what they can with very limited support. It's just that if they didn't have this crazy religious ideas about everything with technology, it would be hopefully much easier. Well, that's what happens when you probably use abominable intelligence. So, now I should probably be able to enable that turret, because we should be out of its range. I hope, so we can take care of problems behind us. Or it's just wishful thinking, I don't know. 100% sure, but I have to say this game is gorgeous. It's so pretty and it's freaking effectful and as you notice I kind of scream a little bit now and then whenever I see something. Whenever I see the gene stealers bounce. Now there's something, there's a blip to my right, so it might be a cultist and I hope... Mm! Okay, never mind. There are, cult there are cultists. Did I say to my left? No, I said to, I thought it would be to my right. Well, they are very small, but I have to remember I'm a post-human. I'm about like three meters tall or something. Wow, he was hard to kill. Now let's hope we can destroy this node thingy. Active in power. Okay. Ooh. 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 What are those bulbous things on them? It's like growths of some kind. I can't even see what the hell I'm doing. I'm just hoping that I'll, I'll survive this. Trying to kick some ass. Ah, there's so freaking many of them. I should have known. I oh fuck my life. My okay, I kind of screwed up majorly here. Yeah, we're kind of fucked. <laughs> I screwed up really bad, didn't I? Yeah, I sure did. So, close, close. Well, thank you, brother, for killing everything that we can see. Oh, I missed something over here. Crap. Mm, no, 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 don't touch it. No touchy. 
I let one brother die, and that's kind of stupid because that was my the guy who could actually heal me. And I'm about to die myself. So we're kind of... Can you just forget this? I probably need to reload anyway. Well, it was a nest. So... What now? I'm kind of out of ideas because well, <laughs> we're mon monumentally screwed, really. But hey, I need to make some mistakes and hopefully learn from them. And we should use the side gate. Side gate launch. We're about to leave, and I can heal myself. And that's kind of a neat feature that I can actually, you know, go and heal up and stuff. Hmm. I want to try out the assault can just for fun. So, boys, let's go back. Does this mean that I have to get a new? Did they revive my apothecary, or...? Yes, they did. I have a new... new friend with me. Hey, Bob, how are you doing? So I have 400 shots in my soul cap, and I'm hoping that that will be enough. Now the question... oh my goodness, that's so far away. But still, it's good that there are they are really using the entirety of the map. I like that. It's very, very clever of them. Clever as in, I have to huff, huff, ugh, huff around all over the place uh, <clears throat> to find what I need to find. But still, it's a cool thing. I like the storm paper so far. It's been really, really cool. Been really cool to use, um, but still, I need to try out all the other weapons just to see see just how effective they are and if they are if, if it will be anything that fits my playstyle. I'm usually usually the long range kind of guy. Uh, whenever I play any kind of FPS, I stay away from any kind of close combat because that's not what I'm very good at. Um, I'm good at mostly at the sniper shooting. Does that mean that there's a lot of them now? Ah! Uh -huh. um, well, there's a slight delay in firing, but it's perfect for spray and pray and hope for the best. Which is kind of, kind of cool. And I like the fact that I can walk around while using it. And I could reload it. I was not sure about that. So I have 400 rounds. Okay, so they despawn really quickly. So... And over here. Let's shimmy about. I shouldn't hurry too much. Because... Oh, I didn't even see you there. You guys are so insignificantly small that I can't, can hardly see you. Alright, this was uh, not the best idea I've ever had. Uh, using the assault cannon is kind of fun, but this is a bad idea. <laughs> this went horribly wrong really quickly. <laughs> so, reload. So, I just need to hit in the general vicinity of these guys. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Yeah, there's a turret here. Oh, it's disabled. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Two assault cannons. I can't make this up. 
this is hilarious. And I went, of course, as fuck. <laughs> oh my. Oh well, never mind. So I'm just wondering, since I can do the scan thingy, does that help me in any way to find any kind of like relics? I don't know. Just wondering. Um, so I'm guessing that the thingy on the left now is my okay. The right is my psi power, and the left is probably my health, which would kind of make sense. Or considering now. We're about to enter a new area. And my scan shows nothing here. So, there's plenty of blips going about. So, how about we just do a uh, For the Emperor and hope for the best? I'm not doing the right thing, I think. Oh, there's another. There's two turrets here. I need to disable that one. Otherwise, it will freaking kill me. How about this one? Can I do anything with that? Nope. Oh, I disabled it, and I need some help. Before we continue. Thank you. Brother, I don't know your name. <laughs> oh, I love this weapon. Okay, we're about to enter the, the nest. And I look forward to it. Lots and lots. And this is actually... It's really a lot of fun to just spray out lots of lots of adamantium bullets and stuff. <laughs> there we go. It's much quicker, I have to say. Really. This is blocked, so I need to unblock. Oh, guys, keep hold my back. No, they're not. You're just being a drama queen right now. There we go. <laughs> this is hilarious. Alright, so I need to do much better now. They are coming. Yeah, they can, might be coming. I don't really care at the moment. Because uh, what I need to do is activate all these things, and there we go. Wait, what? Destroy? Oh, I need to do like that. Well, guys, you're not allowed up here. There we go. And over here. Ah. That's it. That's it. Uh, I'm not much of a close combat dude, I'm more of a shoot and hope that you shoot you in your face and say goodbye kind of person. Uh, whoa, we are so many. Oh, note to self, as I said, I'm not going to use the assault cannon again, because that was a horrible, horrible idea. Mission accomplished! There we go! We oh, I got the heavy flamer now. Holy fuck, I love that. You just received new equipment for your incoming mission. It is available at the bridgehead, along with the cur your current equipment. So, let's listen to the next... Grandmaster, whatever it is. we have the opportunity to find out more about the location of the Dark Angel ship. Affirmative, Brother Epistolary. Place an Augur Primus at the attached coordinates. 
Place the data transmitter. It will send information about nearby defense and energy systems to Grandmaster Baliel, so that he can triangulate the location of the ancient ship. So that's what we're doing here. So we are actually here to find out more information about the Dark Angels, Angel's ship. If you don't know that, I kind of missed that entirely. But that's what happens when you haven't really paid attention to the game. We're still on the same map, so we just need to move to another location. But we destroyed the nests, and that's good. Still a lot of spawn points, and I'm hoping that these, these here, and the ones over here now are neutralized at least. That's what I'm hoping, but that's not a guarantee, of course. Hmm. Who knows? Who knows? Well, it's hard to say, but anyways, that will be the end of this episode. Next time, we will pick up where we left off, and we'll try to get to the point here, which is our primary objective right now, to triangulate the old Dark Angels, um, the old Dark Angels vessel that we're working for. In any case, thanks so much for watching, guys, and if you liked what you saw, do leave a like and a comment. But now, I'm going to sign off, and I'll see you guys later.